Good morning, everyone. We're back with our fifth episode of Buck TV. It's almost Thanksgiving, and you know what that means. No, no school! We still have the rest of today. Hmm. Right now, let's check in with Alex with our very first, could be our last, weather report. Hi, I'm Alex, the weatherman. This is my first ever weather report. Warning. This is not an actual real-time weather report, which should not be considered a reliable weather reporting service. Well, it looks like it was 100% that it was snowing at the time we shot this. It might still be snowing now, or there might be some snow on the ground. Make sure you bundle up for those chilly temperatures. Let's go to uh, Jacob, who's actually experiencing the weather. As you can see, I'm outside, snowy, cold, and keeps up like this. Hopefully we'll have a snow day. We'll stay inside. Yeah. Let's go back to Rachel in the studio. Thank you, Alex, for the totally irrelevant weather report. Now it's time for What You Know About Me with our very own Buck TV producer, Miss Goodwin. Mrs. Goodwin here. Um, it's very weird to be on this side of the camera for Buck TV, but um, here's what you know about me. All right, the first question is, what is your favorite sport to watch and to play? Um, well, in high school, I played basketball and soccer. Um, I don't really do much of that anymore, but I do like to watch basketball, and I try to play golf, but I'm not very good. What is your favorite thing to do outside of work? Um, outside of work, I like to just relax and um, not worry about school stuff, but I like to shop and I enjoy taking Zumba and Jazzercise classes. Don't laugh. What is your favorite Apple device? Um, I'd have to say the iPad. That's really the only one that I actually use at home. Um, I don't have an iPhone. I have a Samsung, so I really like my iPad though. What made you realize you wanted to be a math teacher? Well, I actually went to college for um, middle childhood language, language arts and social studies. Um, but once I started taking those history classes, I realized I'm really not interested in this. And I figured I should get into math because I might be more likely to get a job in math. And so far, it, it's worked out pretty well because that's all I've been teaching is math, not language arts. And there's a bonus question in here. How many kids do you have? Um, well, I have a daughter, um, Kara, who's five years old, and I have a son, Chase, who's two, and actually, I got one on the way, so you guys do the math. Um, this is what you know about me. I think you learned uh, an awful lot today. All right, thanks. The Bucks boys basketball team is currently underway. Here's some footage of our game against Brooklyn. Go out there and support the Bucks. Oh, sure. 
That reminds me of our new segment called Dear Rachel, where our viewers can write in and ask for my advice. Let's see what our viewers need my expert advice on today. Oh, sorry, didn't see it there. Here's our first letter for today. Dear Rachel, a friend of mine is getting cyberbullied by one of my best friends. What do you think the best way to solve this problem without getting involved would be? Sincerely, frustrated friend. Dear frustrated friend, you sure are in a tough spot. I would say that you could tell an adult at home, or if you tell someone at school, Deputy Easter Day could get involved and investigate it because cyberbullying is a crime. Here's our second letter. Dear Rachel, my hamster is getting very fat and is having trouble moving around. I don't know what to do. Sincerely, Hopeless in a Cage. Dear Hopeless in a Cage, maybe it's time for a new hamster. Just kidding. I would say limit his food amounts. Don't give him as much. And buy him a scooter to move around on. If you are in need of advice, please submit your Dear Rachel letter to Miss Goodwin's mailbox in the office. What are you doing for Thanksgiving? Food. What? Food. Apparently Jacob is eating a lot of food. This, here's our top ten list of Thanksgiving Day traditions. Number 10, shopping on Black Friday. Number 9, having a movie marathon. Number 8, playing family football outside. Number 7, traveling to visit out-of-town relatives. Number 6, helping cook Thanksgiving dinner. Number 5, fighting over the wishbone. Number 4, playing outside with cousins. Number three, watching the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade. Number two, watching football all day. Number one, eating Thanksgiving dinner with family. All right, Bucks, enjoy the time off with your families. I'm Morgan, have a great day. Jacob, are you still with us? We're signing off now. Yeah, I'm still here. It's Jacob signing off. See you guys. I'm going to enjoy your food. So yeah. Stay classy, Bucks. Happy Thanksgiving. <laughs>